I'm Henry Bushnell with Yahoo Sports, joined by U.S. Men's National Team and Manchester City goalkeeper Zach Steffen, who's with us on behalf of his Voice Now Foundation, um, which we'll get to in a bit. But first, Zach, um, 48 hours ago or so, you officially quit clinched qualification to the World Cup. How does it feel? What's been going through your head uh, the past past couple of days? Uh, it's obviously amazing. It, it, it's really special feeling. Really amazing group of guys um, that we have with the national team, and, and um, so really proud of those guys. Uh, we know we're, we're going to the World Cup. We're speaking about probably 20 minutes after the U.S. and England were drawn together into the same group at the World Cup draw. Were you watching it, and what were your reactions to either watching it or hearing the draw? Yeah, I was watching it. Um, it's funny because uh, Jack really just on this morning, and, and um, he, he was like, "Oh, I, I hope we draw. I hope we draw you guys." Um, and we were just laughing about it, and then we draw them. Um, so it, it's funny how the world works. Um, but yeah, man, it, it's it's exciting. Um, I like our group. Yeah, I have confidence with us. I think we're we're we're, we're just hungry. We're excited. Um, we can't wait to for it to to get here. So there's Jack, Phil Foden, Raheem Sterling, John Stones. A couple of these guys could be part of the team. Can you give us a quick uh, scouting report on the city guys? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, they like to keep the ball um, and keep it on the ground. Um, no, it, it'll be a, it'll be a tough game for sure. They're they're obviously a very highly talented squad, um, and they can fire on all cylinders. And, and so it's going to be a tough game for sure. Um, but those are the kind of games you want, and really to prove to to the rest of the world what we already know. We've heard that from so many guys that this is a really good group to be with. Um, just a tight knit locker room with, with the national team. What's the origin of that chemistry? How did that develop over the past several years? Uh, I think it's just, I think Greg and, and his coaching staff, they, they've done a really good job of, of creating a good culture of coming into camp and, and working hard and, and, and no egos, being humble and being ready and being hungry just to prove the world wrong that, that USA soccer can play, that we can play and we can compete against the, the, the best teams in the world. And, and we're young, we have a lot of potential. We're very hungry, uh, very motivated, and, and just very passionate to go out there and, and work for each other and, and to have fun and enjoy it and, and be the best that we can be. So let's switch gears a bit. Um, Zach, you, you launched the Voice Now Foundation in, in 2020. Can you take us through the origin story a bit, um, the inspiration behind it and, and what you guys are trying to achieve? Yeah, so we, we founded it after the, uh, the murder of George Floyd. And I was in Germany at the time um, during COVID. Um, and this video pops up online and um, I start watching like the first 20, 30 seconds. Uh, and I can't watch it because I, I saw the headlines already. I know I knew what happened and, and I just couldn't finish it. Um, still to this day, I have yet to, to watch it um, or to finish it. Um, and yeah, man, I mean, I felt how we all felt angry, mad, sad, confused, um, yeah, pissed off. And so I want to use my platform to speak out and use my connections that I've made throughout my career and, and kind of create a community that believes in giving back to the less fortunate, the underprivileged back in America. We've been able to give them money for food, give them money for backpacks, for Wi-Fi, for new laptops, and for them to keep the school open longer um, some days so that the kids, stays, the kids stay off the streets um, after school. Um, so it's all just about, about giving back to the future generations and giving them resources and, and opportunities that I had growing up to that got me to where um, I am today. To wrap up here, Zach, how can people get involved? How can people support um, the foundation? And is there anything else you'd uh, want to say about it? So we just um, teamed up with OneFootball, um, a big platform, soccer uh, platform over here. And we made a limited clothing line. And it's cool because I love fashion. And with Voice Now, we wanted to create some clothing pieces that all proceeds would go to the Boys and Girls Club in, in America um, to help out these kids. So we're, we're selling that. You can also follow us on our social platforms. Yeah, we're just trying to give back, man, trying to raise money and, and um, trying to make the world a better place uh, for the future generations. Well, Zach Steffen, as he's getting ready for the stretch run here at Man City um, and, and then eventually a World Cup, um, really appreciate your time and appreciate you joining us. No problem, man. Thanks for having me.